Hello everyone and welcome to my Formula 1 uh, 2018 career mode. We're in part 16 of uh, 21 of our season 1 of Formula 1 season with the Red Bull racing team. As you see we have the final 13 laps to go and we're 5 minutes away of rain over here in Russia. I have done a tremendous job today going back on top. I'm leading this thing about a minute and two seconds behind Lewis Hamilton. And Kimi Raikkonen is currently running in third place. And this time I'm doing very well. Uh, I'm doing a superior job managing my tires this time compared to last week at Singapore where I was having some tire problems, so was everyone else. Ooh, I've had a uh, unbeatable race today. Uh, I ran flawless and uh, tires been coming out nice and smooth. I did a good job in practicing qualifying, saving my tires. And there you see, uh, I was about to put a lap on uh, the Singapore winner, Fernando Alonso. He's having another impressive race today. Apparently running in fourth place, he's just gonna let me go, but thank you. And once again, great job for Toadmasters of rolling in some real life graphics here in Russia. In the Russian Grand Prix. The walls used to be wider over there than compared to last season's last season's for 2017 game. They were wider over there, but now it's close to the wall. Well, it looks like the conditions are going to be changing because there's a, a threat of heavy rain uh, coming through the area in Sochi, Russia. the ravishing Russian uh, today. Compared to last year, I used to hit the walls coming into this corner over here, but it's not a problem anymore for this 2018 game. I'm handling it pr pretty well. And there used to be a glitch problem uh, over in that turn. Every time I speed up, then the car uh, hits under heavy braking. That was a problem with the 2017 game, but let's take the 2018 game, they fixed that problem. I started the race with uh, with Ultra Softs. Um, also, in the start of the race, I had a little stumble at the start, but so bad I didn't uh, hit the wall. But there were th there was a three car crash uh, between Ocon and it looks like my teammate Max Verstappen was involved in it uh, that knocked them out of the race, and also Charles Leclerc was also out of the race. They only got about 16 cars left in the field. see rain coming down into the picture. It's coming down and it's going to come down hard. So we're not going to be very far from uh, changing the tires to intermediates or full wets. But it's up to my race strategist Jeff to see uh, if he will make the decision to change into intermediates. Ten laps to 
laps to go. Okay, I still got the uh, fresh ultras on. I've had these ultras for the last 10 laps already. Hamilton. And also in the last 10 laps, if I win this race, I, I pretty much could wrap up the world championship right here in Russia. Also during this race, uh, when I was beginning the Russian Grand Prix, we had a regulation change uh, announced. So the aerodynamics is uh, now going into the regulation change, so I have to do some uh, adopted parts uh, for the next uh, six weeks. If I don't make those changes in the adapted parts, then it will start all over again. So I'm going to have to uh, adopt only, I only had five uh, changes on the aerodynamics, so that's pretty good. But in the upcoming seasons, there is going to be more regulation change on, uh, on other uh, mechanic parts like the chassis, the powertrain, and also the durability. So we'll keep on track of those changes when I go into the upcoming season. Right now, I'm right behind the third place uh, car, just about to put Kimi Räikkönen in the lap down. If I do win the World Championship for Red Bull, I'm pretty sure that I'm going to uh, be moving to the Mercedes team. Still can't believe we're still staying out of these ultras and now the rain is uh, starting to intensify. Looks like my tires are going down because uh, the rain is uh, coming into play.
I'm not far behind Hamilton. Hamilton is now caught in traffic with somebody. It looks like that's one of the... Uh, and we finally going to change these tires. Sorry I made that mistake. Uh, I'm not going to settle in for no three second time penalty for corner cutting. It's just that the track is starting to get so slippery out there. And Hamilton has already changed to the intermediates and so did I. Somebody made the wrong mistake with the tire strategy. I was going to go to ultras, but I'm not going to do that. I'm going to go to, straight on to intermediates. Let's hope we can beat, beat out the heavy rain because. Uh, Rain is going to start to get very heavy in the next five minutes. And we're just about maybe, uh, let's see, seven laps to go, uh, seven laps away of finishing this race. But I think we're going to stay on with the intermediates when the heavy rain arrives. Change over to lean on my fuel mix, burning them up a little too much.
Man, even my lean mix is uh, eating up the fuel a little bit. and it looks like this will be four laps away and I could be clinching my 10th world championship. And that lap car you see up ahead, that was Brendan Harley. He's currently running in 11th place. Not a bad day for the uh, Toro Rosso Hondas. Harley is 11th and Gasly uh, is in 10th place. tires are much cooler cooler than those hotter tires. to go. for the final two laps of the race. Come on, Gasly. Let me lie. Uh, I didn't pre appreciate that collision with Gasly. Not true. But anyway, we're two laps away. Uh, luckily, my wing didn't get damaged after that one. see heavy rain coming into the area. Now we don't have to come in again to change those intermediates, but just gonna select this tire as it is because we're in the almost to the final lap of this race. And I'm about to win my 15th uh, my 
15th win in the season one uh, 2018 uh, Formula One uh, World Championship. Alonso, he's already dropped into eighth place. <laughs> you can enjoy your win last week at Singapore. When I come back there next, when I come back there for the next season in the Mercedes, maybe this time I'll manage my strategy even better. Now we're in the final lap of this race. I'm about to get my 15th win in the season one 2018 Formula One season. It'll be my 203rd career win. Hmm. After last week having a rough race at Singapore, finishing runner-up, the Red Bull is going to come back on top here at the Russian Grand Prix. And let's see uh, if we clinch the championship. If we don't finish the championship of Russia, I think we're pretty well, we'll, we'll do it in Japan. The city uh, in the next two years is going to be hosting the Summer Olympic Games. Well, it was a great race, I stayed out of trouble. I didn't hit the wall and everything. I know I had that little corner cut when I was trying to make it into the pits to change my tires into intermediates. Well, and I didn't, uh, I didn't outlap everybody in the field because I see there's Lewis Hamilton right behind him. He's currently the, the runner-up spot. You know, we're just two corners away. I'm making the checkered flag. Um, make it clean on the final two quarters, and here we are. And I win my 15th race in the season one Formula One season. And there it is. And and it's just official. And it is official that I won my 10th World Championship. I am now the Formula One Drivers World Champion for the 10th time. What a great race in, in Russia, and, and what a way to do it at, in the rain. <laughs> I think we'll call this the, the Russian Roulette Championship. And we're going to stay with you right here because uh, I think there is a, uh, a championship uh, cut scene coming up. And there it is, I win my 10th World Championship. I am so happy. What a great season I had with this Red Bull uh, Aston Martin team. And I have to thank so much for, for being on this team and everything, but I'm moving along next season to go to the Mercedes-Benz. Yeah, this is me, winning my 10th World Championship. season I think it was a superb season winning 15 races except for that uh, stay with you right here because I just officially just won my 10th world championship in Formula One. Even though uh, last year, 2017, I won nine world championships and now I win 10 world championships now, starting from the 2018 Formula One season. And I'd like to thank Red Bull Racing for all their hard work and effort and, and thank them so much for letting me have this championship for one. But then next season, I'm going to require more world championships with Mercedes. So
So on behalf of the Speed Chapel organization, thank you so much. I've really worked so hard at getting this Formula One game in, in August, and it's only been out for about a week, and I've already won the first 16 races and 15 wins, and I'm already now world champion. And we're going to take a look at the standings, and uh, so during the last uh, five races, I'm just going to uh, keep recording and everything, now that I already won the World Championship. I was 152 ahead, and I've already clinched. And Lewis Hamilton will have to settle for second, Vettel third, and we're in fourth, and we're stopping fifth. And the Constructors standings, we haven't clinched the uh, Constructors Championship yet, because Red Bull Racing is leading. We have a 159-point deficit over the Mercedes, Goodyear, Ferrari, and how about McLaren? The last two races, uh, they have been doing a wonderful job so far. And Haas has already dropped to sixth place, and Renault is in fifth. Well, we're going to be moving on to the next race. We'll be in Japan, now that the championship has already been clinched. With the Speed J-Po organization, let's hope I can go to the Mercedes team. And we'll see you next time. And goodbye.